Well, we're working uh, some Cal 1 problems. I call it Cal 1. It's usually first semester of calculus. We sometimes call it calculus 1. So anyway, whatever. We're doing differentials. And uh, here's problems we're going to be uh, working on. Um, we're going to do uh, estimation of error concept. We're going to be given a ball bearing um, measured to be uh, 0.9 inches. I guess I should have put zero in front of that, I don't know. All right, 0 0.9 inches. If the measurement is correct with 0 0.01 inches, we're going to estimate the propagation error in the volume V of the ball bearing. Okay, so, <clears throat> and something else we're going to do, we're also going to find relative error and percent error while we're at it. So it's not going to be too bad. You're going to need to know a formula, and that's the uh, formula for the volume of a sphere. The volume of a sphere. Okay. All right. The first thing I'm going to do here is is maybe let's state a formula we're going to need. The volume of a sphere is v is equal to four thirds pi r cubed, if I remember right. Four thirds pi r cubed and then uh, state some numbers that we uh, talked about and that is the radius of the ball bearing is to be measured at 0 0.9 and I think said inches or something like that 0 0.9 inches and our measurement is to be correct within 0 0.01 so that's going to be our delta r our delta r will be stated as 0 0.01 and actually it's going to be uh, like within 0 0.01 so that means it's going to be a plus 0 0.01 and a minus 0 0.01 so a minus 0 0.01 so we got to be within that tolerance there now to approximate the propagated error in the volume we want to differentiate V to obtain DV over DR so you should know how to do this so we got DV over DR Right, we're taking the derivative of the volume with respect to r. So we take the 3, bring it out front. So we're going to be left with 4 pi r squared. 4 pi r squared. Now to approximate delta v by dv, remember that's what we're wanting to do. That approximation thing. So d delta v which is going to be approximately dv right? and remember what dv is okay we're going to uh, take the dr and bring it up to the top but this is going to be equal to 4 pi r squared dr All right, 4 pi r squared dr and now what we're going to do is simply just plug our numbers in. We've got, uh, we just plug our R in and then our DR. Remember the uh, uh, the DR up here? So let's just do that. So we have four pi and then this is 0 0.9 squared. Now remember dr, right, is our delta r. I think I mentioned that somewhere in there. Um, and that's going to be the uh, 0 0.01. 0 0.01. Now remember this is plus or minus here. Okay, we don't want to forget that. And of course, we plug all this into the calculator and we end up.